Big news from Orlando SeaWorld Entertainment and Sesame Workshop. They've joined forces to bring you Sesame Street at SeaWorld Orlando, part of Sesame Street's 50th anniversary this year. Take a look. There's a whole lot more to see and do at SeaWorld. The company is celebrating the grand opening of their six-acre world-class attraction, Sesame Street at SeaWorld Orlando. So we are so excited to welcome guests to SeaWorld Orlando and open Sesame Street here. It's our, one of our biggest expansions in our parks. There's so much to do. There's over 30 new things for guests to explore and discover, including wet play and dry play areas, um, immersive interactions throughout the land, one, two, three, stew, Mr. Hooper, Big Bird's Nest, there's a little bit of everything for everyone. And it's just as you'd imagine the iconic Sesame Street neighborhood would be. And of course, everyone's favorite furry friends. See them here and everywhere, including SeaWorld's first ever daily parade. It's our very first parade at SeaWorld Orlando, and we're so excited. You can meet 12 characters. They are all over the street. There's really not a bad place to watch the parade, which is great. When it's time to eat, they've got that covered too. We have two specialty food trucks, and there's an interactive within the food truck area. My favorite interactive actually is where you meet Chef Gonger and Cookie Monster at their foodie truck and they lead you on a little cooking chaos where you get to make three recipes. The last recipe is a silly pizza that you get to choose the ingredients for. And let's not forget the rides. So we have six newly themed rides and the best part is they all have a character overlay to them. There is a Elmo Choo Choo Train which is one of my favorites. A Super Grover's Boxcar Derby Race which is a first coaster for a lot of little once. For more information or to plan a trip, check out SeaWorldOrlando.com slash Sesame Street.